Um, this is about the Riverview Farm Park. And this time we'll start with Mr. Jenkins and just go around kind of like. This is, um, do you want me to read it all? <laughs> the, que the question, you, you all probably know the story. <laughs> <laughs> you say it's just, the just the question. Uh, will, you, will you honor the commitment made in 1991 for a park encompassing all of City Farm? Um, I could do all three at once. Should I do that? Yes. Will you support, and I, I can repeat them if you want. You can just say yes, 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 or no, 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 whatever. The second one, will you support removing the understudy designation and the comprehensive plan? And three, will you uh, maintain public ownership and present zoning of City Farm and, and all the whole area uh, so that uh, there would not uh, be any housing development there? First of all, I agree completely that uh, we should honor the 1991 commitment to keep Riverview Farm Park a park for the people. Um, I think that it's really important for us as leaders to honor the commitments that leaders before us have made. The public is counting on us to do the right thing, and uh, we need to uh, look forward in our city for our future, for our children's future, and I look forward to that being a part for the next uh, 100 years or more, okay? Uh, as far as the comprehensive plan, I would agree 100% that we need to take the understudy um, designation off of that. It needs to be considered a park because that's what it's going to be. Um, I am against uh, the development of uh, Riverview Farm Park. I believe it should remain in the public uh, hands. Uh, not only am I against residential development, I am against commercial development and making it an entertainment venue. Thank you. Thank you very much.